I am one with my I am presence. And my Holy Christ self. My personalities, body elemental, and new spirit. All parts of my being are in balance, harmony, and alignment. I pull in my aura so it is fully contained within Metatron's cosmic egg. And I am now ready for today's message. Greetings, beloveds. I welcome you again into my heart of infinite joy and infinite love and the infinite light energy that I wish to give to each and every one of you. You are all my beloved children. And yes, even those of the dark side who have chosen another path. They too are my children. And yet the time has now come for me to separate those of my children who wish to do harm to their brothers and sisters from those of you who have decided that love, kindness, and goodness are the only expressions that you wish to share with the world. This can be a painful time for many. For there are those of you in the light who know of these people on the dark side. You may be related to one of them and you may hold in your heart a very strong desire to assist them to get them to change their ways. But the time is quickly approaching when the choices that they have made and continue quite obstinately to stick to will result in certain actions taking place that I have decided to allow at this time on your planet. This is a severing of certain realities and the completion of certain timelines that will no longer be allowed to continue. The influence of the dark side has come to a head like a great pimple on the face of humanity. And its eruption will have a certain fallout on many people. as they have lived perhaps in fear of the dark side and have themselves made certain choices which will result in their experiencing a certain fallout from this eruption. But fear not, beloveds. 
This is indeed a time of great joy. As the light will once again be in its place of supremacy in the hearts and in the minds of all of humanity. The turning point has been reached. The 100th monkey has awakened. And therefore, all of the support that you need at this time to go through this experience harmoniously is available to you and is around you even right now in this very moment whether you are able to see it or not it is there so as the upcoming events unfold beloveds I ask you to call to me to call to all of your angels to call to your entire spiritual support system to be with you and they will answer your call they will be present in the very atmosphere around you if your eyes are truly open and your heart you will be able to see them or to feel them around you trust in your moment to moment guidance that you will receive as to what to do and where to be you may receive this guidance in the form of hearing your own voice there will not be a big black and white sign being waved at you saying do this or do that and most probably the angels will not be taking physical form in front of you and telling you what to do no beloveds it will be much more gentle and much more subtle than that you will feel as if a portion of yourself is talking to you and whispering in a voice try this go here do that all I can ask beloved is that you follow that gentle voice and do what it asks you to do if you can do this now before the events arrive it will be much easier for you to distinguish between the voice of the ego mind and the voice of fear and the voice of the divine mind which is the voice of love if you choose to follow the wrong voice even then beloveds do not fear you may have some minor negative experiences befall you because of that choice but in the long run there will be no lasting harm it may cause you to experience these events in a more negative fashion rather than in the pure and absolute bliss which can be experienced at all times 
by those who have firmly established their connection to their I Am Presence or to their God by whatever name they call the Creator. It is my wish that you be able to experience all of life in a state of absolute joy. But as most of you are not quite there yet, please make it a priority to make this connection to your divine self as strong as you possibly can at this time. Please let this be your priority. Take time from your busy day to establish this connection. It is much easier to do it in a calm and peaceful state. It will be much more difficult if you are frightened or if you are hurt or if you are in doubt. All negative thoughts and emotions make it much more difficult to experience this connection. That is why I have been asking you and will continue to ask you to make it a priority to establish the connection with your divine self now. Do not wait for tomorrow, for tomorrow may be too late. Now that the tipping point has been reached, these events can unfold at almost any moment. And I wish you to be prepared. Please know that if you do not feel prepared, ask for my presence and I will be there with you. I will help you. I will sustain you through all events. For you are my beloved child. And I will not let any lasting harm come to you. But you may experience some minor negativity because of the choices that you have made and are continuing to make. Just understand that I do not expect 100% purity or 100% perfection on your part in order for you to be enfolded in my protection. All that I require is that you ask for it, beloveds. This protection will be awarded to all who ask for it. There are those who have denied my protection in the past and who at the very last minute when their world starts to fall crashing down upon them will at last finally reach out and call to God for assistance. Beloveds, they too will be granted assistance, but not in the same way as you. They will be removed from this planet and they will have to begin their school of life at a new starting point on a new planet where they will once again be offered the same opportunities 
that have been granted to every single evolving human being on the planet at this time. But they will no longer be powerful. They will no longer have the right to harm any other human being that will be remaining on this planet and going forth with the planet in her ascension. That is the separation that is occurring now, beloveds. It has long been foretold. It has been awaited by many of you for a very long time. So be grateful that this is finally occurring. Understand that every individual's experience of this event will be absolutely perfect for them in harmony with their own karmic agreements and their own spiritual development. It will definitely be easier and more graceful for those of you who have given your lives to God. But it will be perfect for each and every one. Let your hearts be at peace about this, beloveds. Fill your being with joy, faith, and trust, and know that all is well. I thank you for listening to these videos. I love you, and I bless you. I am Metatron.